Hey guys, Thorne Bradley here, Pro Subs athlete and coach. Today I'm gonna to give you a quick and unique tip on how to deal with something I think a lot of people struggle with. Now whether you're a runner or you just work really hard in the gym, chances are you've probably dealt with tight hips, especially in the anterior area, which would be the front of your hips. Now there's a couple of muscles happening there in that muscle group that are responsible for these tight hips. Unfortunately, when most people start dealing with that tightness and the aggravation and a little bit of pain up front, they lean on rolling and stretching. Now, no knock on stretching, but chances are if that's what you've been leaning on, you're not gonna get the results you're looking for for relief in your hips. So I'm gonna show you an exercise today that you can either use as a warm up or a treatment two to three times a week to instantly relieve that pain you've been dealing with in your hips. And I'm telling you, when you try it, you're gonna be extremely surprised at how quickly it starts to work. Now, the muscle we're gonna be targeting today with this movement is called the rectus femoris. It exists in the quad, but it does work as a very weak hip flexor. And in the average human, it's just not strong. We spend so much time sitting, driving, texting on our computers. We're really not blessed with strong hips anymore. So if we can address that through small exercises that target that weak region of the hip, you'll see instantaneous pain relief. So like I said, we're gonna to wanna to do this exercise either two to three times a week on your own time or to warm up for your leg days or any day where you're about to be squatting or lunging or doing any of these hinging type movements. So let me show you what I'm talking about here. We're gonna have one leg up on the bench. Now with my other leg, what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to drag it out to an angle that challenges me for my flexibility and my mobility. For me, that's about here. Once you get there, what I want you to do is I want you to grab the bench with your hands and keep very good posture with your upper body. Now all we're gonna do is we're gonna raise, flex, hold, squeeze, back down slow and under control, raise, flex, squeeze, back down under control, and we're going to repeat this motion for three sets of six reps on each side. Very controlled and very, very focused on that squeeze up in the upper hip. Now once again, I want you to notice that my toe is pointing towards my forehead, not away from me. I'm going to flex and squeeze and make sure that my leg is perfectly straight, Back down, light tap, go again. Now if this ever gets too easy for you, what you can do is, is you can start practicing by dragging that leg just wider and wider each time you do it. Now remember, you can do this two to three times a week on your own, at home. You can do it without a bench by doing it on the floor. But my favorite way to do it is before every leg day. And it makes me feel strong and mobile during my squatting patterns. I hope you enjoyed my tip today. I'll talk to you guys soon.